Hello, everyone. Well, I've come in to sit in here tonight because <clears throat> I've been practicing trance. So I'm going to ask one of the higher beings or one of my higher guides to come in and speak an inspirational message through me. I'm just going to make sure the light's a little bit better. So just bear with me. I will probably do a little bit of talking at the end after I come out. Please bear with me. You can also watch to see if uh, there is any transfiguration of my face. Good evening, beautiful ones. Thank you for being here. And thank you for traversing this time on planet Earth. For there are, are a great many things unfolding around this beautiful planet. And many things yet to unfold. There is word amongst uh, the people that uh, there is a possibility of more of these outbreaks of this viral infection. But we don't really want to talk about that today. We just want to say about the travesty that has taken place throughout the human population. But we want to say that we feel to think of polarities. So the opposite to that is the light, the love that is being felt, the compassion for other people, and all of those wonderful emotions 
and caring attitudes that are taking place around this earth. And we are so overjoyed that it is bringing more of humanity together. We do realize that there is uh, a forcement of division that is trying to play out also through humanity. But even so, we wish you to focus on the compassion, the love, the community, the helpfulness. And how many of you are acting with others? And we wish to talk a little bit more about love. Now, as we know, love is the highest frequency that exists. And more and more is it being shown that love and compassion for other people, for animals, for the earth. It is a true opening of the heart of many, many, many individuals. And many do not realize it. But there are many who also do. And it is within this opening of the heart and that overflow and flooding of that love vibration that pours out from the heart of so many, it is that which is going to create many changes. We implore for you to keep this positive outlook and that open heartedness, for it is this within the light of humanity and the soul of each individual that you will overcome many, many things yet to unfold on planet Earth. It is human nature to actually truly be in that place of love. When you think of an infant, a baby that has just been born, that baby is of pure love and that soul is shining out so brightly from that infant. And it is only what that infant and soul together traverse through the journey, we will say, of living this human experience that changes one and closes one and opens one. And it is a roller coaster of emotions, events. But we wish for you now to think back to yourself when you were born, when you first came into this physicality. as that pure essence, that bright light shining out so brightly. And that love that you radiated out at that time and all around you felt it. Even if some of you were born into an atmosphere which wasn't of the best, of the most kindest. But at that moment of pure love, you would have had 
a profound effect on everyone around you, but also through the collective consciousness. And with each baby that is born now, with each soul that comes into this physicality, it is the same. And thankfully, each human who is uh, awakening, as we say, uh, is becoming and bringing the right environment for that beautiful soul and that infant to grow and expand their light. So that soul light will stay expanded and not be closed down. And we understand that many now who are have already lived a lot of their journey through this physicality are also opening up through one reason or another. Their light, their soul light is pushing through, expanding out. And we wish you to imagine this on a larger scale, as if you were looking down from another planet, a spaceship, or uh, just out in space and looking down at the earth and seeing each light ping on, grow bigger. And within that light, looking at planet Earth, Earth as a whole, you will see a network of light, a grid, if you like, of each soul that is lighting, that is expanding their energy all through the heart of the human and of the energy field of the human. But looking down at planet Earth, you will notice that that grid of individual lights is growing and growing. It is, how should we say, a, like a star map of light, but on the Earth. And again, as we say, it is growing and growing. We wish you to ponder on this and think about this concept because it is reality. There is a grid of light growing amongst humanity all around the planet. As each individual may wake up slowly and gradually, may shine their light slowly and gradually, some will not even realize that it's happening. And others will have some form of trauma which will allow that light to break free. We wish you to think about this, to think about your own light, to feel within yourself that expansive feeling of love, of unconditional love, love for yourself, love for the infant and the soul which is in your physical body, and love for humanity, love for the earth, love for the animals, the birds, the insects. And the more you allow yourself to be in that space, the more your light will grow, the more your heart will expand and open. And the more you will Join in with the collective of other human lights, human souls that are growing. And you will make a difference. You will make a difference. And it is so easy, we know, for you to get wrapped up in your day-to-day -day living. But we say to you, please, 
Train yourself, if you like, to think of your heart expanding. To be mindful of what is going on within yourself. For the longer you can keep that vibration up, that light expanding out, your heart open, your soul light expanding, the longer you keep it like that, the more you will train yourself, if you like, to drop all of the old baggage that you once carried and to live that expanded experience. It will be the best, the most important thing that you could do at this time for yourself, but also for the collective. For the more that you are in that vibration and that frequency, the more your own physicality, your own physical body, the immune system will really fire up. And you will draw to you experiences of a higher vibration because you are in that frequency, that love mode, as we would say. We really wish you to feel it, to love you, to love who you are. And as you walk around in your day-to-day -day life, you will expand that out to others and everyone you come into contact with. Whether that be other humans or animals or birds or plants. Every single thing on planet Earth is a sentient being and will feel it. We send you so much love. So much love. We are known as the collective. And we wish you good day for now. Until next time. Thank you, thank you, beautiful ones. Please, if you wish, share this message. Uh, I'm going to um, record as regularly as I can. I'm gonna try and sit to trance on a regular basis. I don't know who's gonna come through each time. I don't know what the message is going to be. Uh, I am aware of it, but I have moved myself out of the way, but I now do not remember much about what was said. So I'm going to record the journey of me opening up to trance. And uh, so it will be quite interesting to see along the pathway what, what unfolds, what takes place. 
So I wish you so much love. And it's evening here. I hope you have a beautiful evening, a beautiful night's sleep, a beautiful day, wherever you are. Please, if you are new to my channel, please subscribe. And please leave comments because it's always nice to read comments. And I will answer. And I wish you so much love too. I'll oh, just say, I forgot to say that uh, if you wish to see more of what I do, please go to my website, which is ginnyjoneshealing.com. Um, I work as an intuitive, so there's lots of different things on there, including healing and readings and light code tattoos and designs. I will uh, put the website in the comment below. So um, take care and much love from me. Bye for now. Bye.